Is this game like Candy Crush? If my favorite game of all time is Candy Crush, will I enjoy this game? No, TF2 is nothing like Candy Crush, but this thread is very much like a putrid pile of flaming goat shit baking in the hot summer sun. Ah, gotta love the friendly TF2 community. Hey peeps, it's your one and not only Dr. Meme Dog. So here I was, just playing some Minesweeper on my GTX 1080, until an idea popped into my mind. A very unique idea indeed. Instead of just making another one of those Volvo is killing TF2, hashtag soldier is OP videos, I decided to go and check out some TF2 Steam discussions. After a few minutes of digging around, I've realized how toxic our community actually is. So I put on one of those hazmat suits and decided to keep digging. I picked out some discussions that I will talk about, some being normal and some I have many questions about that will probably never be answered. Now let's not wait any longer and see for yourself where our community is at. <coughs> Valve should do something for the breast beast. Whoever seen this weapon used in game? To be completely honest, I feel like this guy's answer is practically the same as mine would be. I don't know what the hell a breast beast is. But a Brass Beast, however, I see that used all the time. Just about every heavy I run into has one equipped. So I don't know if this is a troll or someone obsessed with titties, but if they're talking about a Brass Beast, then I still see people using them. Just like some people say, if you got a pocket medic, you're like a moving sentry with that thing. Why are Hoovies a problem? I don't see why. They are playing the game. Well, they are and they aren't playing the game technically. I mean, they're in-game, but they're not playing the game mode. Personally, I'm not a fan of Hoovies. Most of the time I'm on TF2 to play the actual game mode, so when there are Hoovies, it kind of gets annoying. I'm sure there's other things you could be doing, like cooking some mom's spaghetti, instead of crouching and throwing sandwiches in TF2. But if you do intend to play as Hoovy, just do it on a screw around server at least, not a comp server. Why do people try in casual? Title. Well, so somebody actually asked why people try in casual. What are people supposed to do? Play as Hoovies? I feel like this discussion was made by one of those people that just got out of a casual game and got his ass bombarded by a demo man on the opposite team. Also, this guy made a good point. Because TF2 comp is a joke, casual is the real game. I have to agree with this one. At least there is a kick option in casual, so you can play a decent game without any hackers. An open letter to the parents of children who play TF2, in the hopes of catching some of which play TF2 themselves and aren't completely ignorant. So this discussion was a pretty long one, so let me summarize it. It almost seems like it's another one of those 25 year olds who complain about squeakers in game. He would love for parents to sit down with their little loud brat, I mean child, and explain to not use the microphone. Or else like stated, maggots will grow in their sinuses and will move down to devour their squeaky little tongues. And in the end, he left us with this scenario. Or if you're lucky, you get the following witty banter. Hey guys, I just got the lolly chop. What are you, six? What are you, five? Hey kid, I got bigger balls than you ever will. What balls? This leaves us with one question. Why would parents read the forums? Although, I have seen a father playing TF2 with his son before, so I think it's possible. Moving on to the last one. Strangers you would like to see. Black Rose, please. As you know, I'm a salty sniper main and would love to see a strange cozy camper. It would be neat if it counted either the amount of time scoped in, in seconds, or possibly the amount of health regenerated. Preferably the second one. I've realized lots of players still wait for the following weapons to be strangified. Iron Curtain, Big Kill, Ludramorph, Bad Outta Hell, Unarmed Combat, Fortify Compound. Maybe one day, after they released a Pyro or Jungle Update in 2020. But to get you involved, be sure to comment down below a weapon that you would like to see strangified. But apart from that, thank you for tuning in. Be sure to drop a like, subscribe and follow my Twitter for any updates or just dank memes. I'll see you next time. Bye peeps, have a nice day.